entrance. So I need to take this chance to party while I can. And besides, outside of Sunny, I don't think anyone invited even likes Claudia. Hey, is my dad reachable? Yeah, Sonny said he was stopping by the office, then heading over to the Metro Court. There's something wrong? Oh, uh, yeah. It's about Claudia. I have to tell my dad. Can you imagine the look on Sonny and Dante's faces? When I tell them their father and son? He won't do it. Well, honey, I can't wait to expose you for the lying piece of trash that you are. Keeping the secret from your own son? From your son's father? If I were Sonny and Dante, I'd be pissed as hell. Even you aren't this vindictive, Claudia. I'm just supporting my husband. He has a right to know about the child you've been keeping secret from him. Screw self you, you psycho bitch! <laughs> Good. Things are going down, and Anthony wants you safe. I gotta find my sister. Sonny's about to get information that's gonna get a kill. So what? Nobody gives a rat's ass about Claudia except for you. Play it again. Jerry Jacks. Claudia, this recording is dated March 31st, 2008. Michael was shot that Friday, April 4th. This proves that Claudia ordered the hit. What do you want to do about it? Guess in the news about Claudia isn't good. That's one way to put it. Well, you know what? Maybe you should wait. A little bit before talking to your father. I mean, he's having this party. He's invited a lot of friends and family. Let him enjoy it a little before you lower the boom. Yeah, yeah, maybe, maybe. Yo, you know what? Why don't you get a second opinion? I mean, if you don't want to talk to me, why don't you run it by Jason or something? Forget it. Forget it. I'll just find a way to do with it myself. And when Devlin died, he said there's more. So Sam and I dug around and we found that the Devlin recorded a lot of his legal business conversations. They hit him at the hospital. Hospital. Yeah, we, we turned up an old gym bag that was in Ian's locker, and in the gym bag was a lot of cash and, and, and these recordings, Sonny. What was on the, on the recordings? Uh, drug deals, mostly. I mean, there was one call with a woman, Claudia, agreeing to do the hit. This right here, this was in the gym bag. The voices are clear. Claudia is the one who sent Ian to the warehouse. She's the reason that this happened. Remember the game that Jerry played with the DVDs and Claudia and the whole thing? Yeah, I remember the game. Jerry was telling the truth. Claudia was guilty. She lied her way out of it. Look, I, I, I know that you don't want to hear this right now. You know what? But it's just I something got, that... I got a birthday party to go to. And it starts in an hour and I expect you to be there. I look like an entry in the Rose Parade. No. I'm really appreciative of you coming with me to this party. You want a second opinion on Dominic? I am more than happy to oblige. You're the one who wants to go to the party, Shh. but I would appreciate your take on Dominic. I have a take on Dominic. He's a nice guy. He is, but he works for Sonny. So, why do you think he works for Sonny? I don't think that he really wants to. I don't know. I just... I think there's a piece of the puzzle that's just missing about this. Like that stuff you don't remember from last night? I know I heard something important. Well, I just can't remember what it is. Maybe it'll come back to you. Well, yeah, I mean, uh, Maxie might be able to help. She actually just texted me and said she's coming. 
Good, because I don't think I can go. Really? Is this like a, an early labor thing? No. No, and as much as I want to go and snoop, and I really, really, really want to go and snoop, I just... I have a condition. It is life-threatening for me and the baby, so I guess I have to be responsible and stay home. Well, do you want me to stay with you? No. Go. Go. I'm fine. Fine. No, I, I honestly, I, I would be happy to just hang out here and, like, watch TV or whatever you want. And avoid spending time with Dominic? I just want to make sure that you're okay. I'm fine. I am. Mertes is here. The boys will be home soon. Maybe I can... Talk him into a quiet game of tiddlywinks. I don't know. Ooh, yippee. Okay, I'm definitely bad at tiddlywinks, so I'm gonna go. But I will give you so many updates when it's all over. Oh, please do. I'm gonna go change. Okay, bye. Have fun. Okay. <sighs> well, I know that you wanted to go to the party as much as I did. But I have to do the right thing, so we're gonna stay home. And we're going to have a nice, quiet evening with your brothers. We can do that, right? So, how much further? Mm -hmm. The docks are right around the corner. Where do you see how brown and gross the water is? Man, I still can't believe Mom threw out my harbor water for the pollution project in science class. By the way, thanks for helping me get more. <sighs> I heard about a storm on the news. It feels like it's coming in. We'll be home soon. Get me out of here! Somebody's in trouble. What should we do? Can anyone hear me? I need help. Please! Get me the hell out! Hello? Please, if somebody's out there, Better please me yell his head off. Nobody can hear him. Somebody! Hello? Is anyone out there? I need to get out. We could call 911. No, if our parents find out we're here, we'd be in huge Anyone trouble. There? Maybe we can help. We don't even know who he is. Now, True, but what if he's the innocent Anyone prisoner of a cruel and merciless sea captain? What if he out. isn't? I say we make an anonymous call. Can anyone hear me? This is life and death. I need to get out. The call would take too long. We have to save his life. <laughs> That is a total exaggeration. Not by much. I was in the lobby when the room next door called and said it sounded like somebody was being murdered. Yeah, she tried. That's a total lie, officer. I swear, I'm not going to be in any more trouble. You can let me go. No, I, I want her taken downtown, arrested, charged with assault. Uh, Are you going to deny me equal protection because my husband is Sonny Corinthos? Look, I'm sorry. I'm going to have to take you downtown. You can't. Yes, thank you. Please, get her out of here. You can't do look, this. You can't look, do this. I have we'll to find someone. We'll be fast. Someone. You behave yourself. You'll be looking for your friend in no time. 